Today we're going to show you how to use Utility Innovative RG45 plug to make the CAT7 patch cord. Normally we will remove the extra wire first, then prepare the cable assembly. For the cables with 7.96 mm, we will use the boot with 8 mm boot. We will put the boot in first and we will keep the earth wire up in the middle. For the wires with the OD of 1.32 mm, we will choose the 1.3 mm load bar. Then we will separate the twisted pair and remove the foils of each pair. Make sure that we cut away all the extra foils to make it clean and neat to prepare the cable assembly. First, we need to do the cable assembly by lining the eight wires in line according to the TIA-568B color code. We will separate the cables and to land the wires according to the color code. All we need to do is pulling straight of the eight wires, make it into one line. and then cut the eight wires. For the length of the cutting, we need to cut it a little bit longer than the load bar. We will cut it around 1.3 millimeter. Then we can compare the width of the wires and the load bar. We can see from the picture that uh, the wires are a little bit wider than the load bar. Then we can pinch the eight wires a little bit down to make it two layer to make it easy to squeeze into the load bar. We can see that uh, it is very easy to make the load bar this way. Then we can check to see the eight wires reach the end of the load bar and then we can check the color of the eight wires to see if it is correct. Then we will put the jacket in We'll make the earth wire up in the front middle of the wire and then to push the jacket into the wires. Make sure that we push the wire into the end of the, of the jacket. We'll push the boot in first, then we're going to use the crimping tool to clip the boot in. Up to this point we can see that the earth wire is already installed. We'll cut away the extra earth wire. Then to check the quality to see if it is reaching the end of the jacket. And then we will plug the cable into the FTP side of the crimping tube to press it 
to make the contact pin of the RJ45 plug goes into the 8 wires. We can see the earth wire is perfectly connected. Up to this point, the patch, uh, the patch cord is perfectly made. And then we're going to do the fluke test to test the quality of the channel and the link. We can see that it passing the fluke test. We can see from the screen that their non-wires are all passing through, including the earth wire.